So the first step is modernization, right? And this is simplifying and digitizing your existing processes and functions. You know, you're not not taking the bad ones and just making them faster, but you know, doing being you know managed in scope, identifying where you can make improvements, and 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 getting that throughout the business. Step two, then, is what he defines as enterprise-wide transformation, and that's you know more complex. Uh, cross value chain efforts. So, you know, fully automating your order to cash or quote to cash processes. Uh, and we're going to look at at how how to do that effectively. How to go from one to two later. Uh, and then, really, what you know, step three is this idea of new business creation, right? Where where you're going to increase revenue from existing channels, you know, in a significant way, or create new revenue sources, uh, which many companies try to jump directly to, but in his model, you should leverage the improvements you made in step one and step two, then to move to step three and be able to, to be able to do that successfully. So, you know, that's really what he's saying here. You know, be manageable in scope. I, you know, those projects should, should, but still provide measurable business impact. And overriding all that is, is to, to initiate projects that will build digital capacity across the organization and provide you with a scalable people and process and technical infrastructure for more and larger projects.